I cannot believe I'm gonna see him, but I am officially ready to go. Ooh, nervous a little more. After 13 years, Martel is finally getting out of prison today. We're grateful. You know, no words can really describe it. It's just, I can't wait for the moments to happen, so I am a little anxious. I do think that my relationship with Martel is forever. I want us to be married as soon as possible. What the f is happening right now? Of course, Martel needs to get on his feet in a career for him to be able to be where he wants to be financially. Hurry the f up and come. Don't nobody gotta do none of this. And rings are a little more expensive, about the $30,000, $40,000 range. But as long as the cut and everything is what it's supposed to be, and we're talking a few carrots, uh, I'm happy. Could this be it? Just like a regular truck? Oh, she would just come the f down. My feet hurt, and now I'm hungry as hell. Oh, I said the police coming in. That's the last thing I need. But I haven't really been like 100% honest with Martel. Honestly, it should have never happened. And I'm hoping that we can just move forward. I want our relationship to be extremely solid as I'm thinking that it will be. It's no fun sitting here with no panties on, by the way. <laughs> it's no fun. Maybe it. I don't know if that's him or not. Is that him? Yes, I think this is it. <laughs> We're happy to be with Kayla today and have her in my arms. We waited for this moment for 13 years. <laughs> I love you. Smells yummy, like a whole entree. Like it smells really good. And I'm ready to eat them up. No, I couldn't wait to touch you, baby. <laughs> me either. After 13 years, I finally got out of prison. And it feels amazing, man, just to be able to re-enter society and enjoy freedom again. Maybe mm. been 12 years old is when I first, you know, started involved in the drug trade all the way up until my incarceration at the age of 24. <laughs> you know, and it's crazy because I really come from a pretty wealthy family. I Me and my cousin, we got pulled over in North Carolina. We was basically profiled two black guys, dreads. I mean, you know, they say I was speeding. They pulled us over, I had the canine sniffing dogs, and doing that search when they found um, cocaine, crack, and firearms. That, that's better? Yeah, it's come off my feet. <laughs> <laughs> it means a lot that Kayla waited, you know, 13 years for me to come home, especially with her being such a young woman. You know, it's hard to get a woman to wait five months, six months. You know, I take my hat off and salute her for staying down with me. I have to report to the halfway house at 11.45. It's 1.30 now. I have around 10 hours and 15 minutes. Ready? Yeah, I'm ready. You ready? Yeah, am I? Over ready. Oh, that's right. Free, baby. Yeah. And you're with me. Yay. Mm. You happy? Or no? Yeah. We're excited, like, once we get back, so. The day we be able to see I happy I did. The last time I was intimate with someone was about a year and eight months ago. Oh, if he did find out the details about me and the other guy's sexual relationship, he would be extremely upset with me. That feels great in here. How about that? If anything, it made me better for him. So why even, you know, dig up that? As long as you're being pleased and you're being satisfied, like, who gives a about what happened prior to that? It just made me a better sex partner. Oh, yeah, this is cool. My bed in prison was half of this, three times hard, um, pillow, no fluff to it. Yeah, it was, it was rough. I am ovulating as of probably 12 o'clock last night. 
Yeah. So, thought about it, and I'm just gonna go ahead and let the universe do what it does. How long is the drive? Probably like five and a half hours. Five and a half hours? Six. So we're definitely pressed for time, but we'll make it. I think this is the day that I'm probably gonna... I think they call it born again virginity. So I'm about to lose mine and I'm kicking y'all out. So that's how this is about to work. Get the f- out. Time to go, fellas. We'll see you guys in maybe an hour. Bye. <laughs> Man, you look sexy. Anybody told you? Mm-hmm. That's it? <laughs> I ain't tripping, you know, I'm pretty sure there'll be plenty more to come.